Open it up. Where is it from? Lift it up so we can see. It's from New Zealand. I never heard that in my life. Where is it? It's where they... They filmed Lord of the Rings in New Zealand. What? Ooh. <laughs> oh my god. All right. First, we're going to start out with Munchos spicy tomato. Munchos spicy tomato. So I'm going to open it up. Do they taste good? Mm. It kind of tastes like fruit. Fruit? It's not spicy. I don't even like to it. To me, it tastes like, um, I'm throwing this in the trash. Mm. Like those uh, Oreos. Mm. Like those Oreos. Like vegetable chips. The veggie yeah. chips? Yeah. Okay. All right, next. Ooh. We're, uh, okay. we're opening. Ripples. Ripples. Chicken flavored. <laughs> we did do the chicken flavored. The kiwi fret. Oh, I didn't even read the thing. Made with New Zealand grown potatoes, this ultra crunchy snack featured features the perfect blend of fresh herbs and savory chicken seasoning. Okay. Chip for you. It's a I'm gonna chip for you. Oh, well, I actually like it. Don't even like it. I have It's pretty good. Yeah. It tastes good though. Okay. Next, we're opening Pascal pineapple lumps with real fruit juice. Oh, fruit juice. Yes. Seduce your taste buds with this chewy New Zealand favorite, be featuring a soft pineapple flavored center coated in delicious milk chocolate. This will probably taste good. I don't know. Yeah, it will taste good. We'll see. Wait, wait for it. Wait, don't, don't eat it yet. Wait for Lily. Both of you just do it at the same okay, time. Three, One, two, two three. Oh. Mmm. I taste a little pinch it. It's like a, a taffy inside. Hard. Oh, I don't like. Didn't even chew it. Yeah, me neither. That's thumbs down. No. Now I want to drink. Bob's really down. Hold on. Now we're gonna try. Oh, this? that tastes so terrible. That terrible. Yeah. Okay. Snackables. Snackables. These little round salted caramel delights are made with cashews and shredded coconut. So you don't have to feel guilty about eating the whole bag. What? We'll see. I, I do not understand anything. This brand is made by Tom and Luke. Hey, Mom. I do not understand what you just said. I think they smell good. Oh, I don't like them. Oh, smell them. Oh my god, they taste like Play Doh. I don't want Yeah, let's not do this one. Oh my god, it tastes like Play Doh. Yeah, let's not do this one. 
this one, guys. I don't even want to eat it. Right, let's go to the next bag. one. That one was in, that one was yuck. You should throw that bag. Chocolate. Prince. Prince. Cadbury's chocolate fish, often rewarded to children for a job well done. This fish-shaped marshmallow is enrolled with a layer of rich Cadbury dairy milk chocolate. Rich. Looks like a fish. Can I see it? It's a fish. The longest fish. Oh there my you god, go. it's pink! Yes. Yes. Pink. Oh, you should try it. It tastes like soap. You don't soap. like it? What does it taste like? <laughs> you like it? Um, I don't like anything but marshmallow. Oh, you don't like it? Okay. Oh, I saw that. Next is so Nestle's Pixie Original Caramel. If you're looking for a longer lasting chew, then this hard caramel covered in rich dark chocolate is the Kiwi Classic for you. So far, everything tastes gross. Oh. This is what it looks like. It kind of looks like a tiny phone. It's very Hard. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you're mm. delicious. You like it? Yeah, this is the first thing we liked. So it's a thumbs up for the pixie caramel. Mm. Next is Cadbury Moro Bar. Need a boost? This snack will deliver. Enjoy a Cadbury chocolate covered caramel and nougat filled treat that oozes deliciousness with every bite. Mm, this tastes like chocolate chips. What does that even mean? A lot of caramel stuff. There you go. Trying to chew. This is good. Next are fruit bursts. Bite down on this chewy lolly to experience a burst of fruity flavors like banana, strawberry, wild berry, orange, and lemon lime. Mm. Here's strawberry. I want strawberry. And you have orange. Do you want to switch? Sissy has banana. Can you open it? What's oh, that flavor again? What does that taste like? This is what it looks like. It looks like a starbird. Feels real hard. Is that too hard for you? No. But it takes up most of my mouth. Tastes like a lolly. Prince. Why well, actually tastes like a lolly? Someone look at Prince. Call him. Call him up to you. Prince. Come here, Prince. 
<laughs> He's not gonna come. Come on, sit back. We're gonna win the next one. All right. Whitaker's Peanut Slab, a Kiwi favorite since 1896. This rich milk chocolate bar is generously filled with roasted peanuts, making it the perfect late night indulgence. Yeah. Mine's pink. I like pink. A whole family likes pink. It's very hard to open. Oh. I like pink and red. This is what it looks like. <laughs> Big, thick piece of chocolate with peanuts in it. I don't like peanuts, so I'm going to skip. I'm going to skip this one. I want to taste it. No, you gotta taste it. Just taste it. Taste you like peanuts? Just take a bite and if you don't like it, give it to mom. Just chocolate and peanuts. It's okay? Let me see. It's good. If it was good, I'll just give it a five stars. But I'm still gonna give it five stars. I'm giving it zero. This one's delicious. The, the whole pack was gross. Something. Next up, fabulous, fabulicious sherbet fizz. With its zippy citrus flavor, these wonderfully tasty and chewy candy tubes are the ideal way to satisfying your craving for both licorice and sherbet. I know you don't know what sherbet is. I think I know what sherbet is. I know what sherbet is. Oh my god, they smell good. This is what they look like. One for you. We'll give them bigger pieces. One for you. Come on, grab it. Oh my god, they do smell delicious. Smell them. Oh wow, that's sour. I don't like it. Oh. Kind of tastes like a. Oh. Oh. One of those little fishy, red fishies candies. They Swedish are fish. Sour. Sour. Is there's too much sour in this? Um, your mouth is you trying to uh, uh, take the wet on your mouth. Well, do you like it? I taste it. I taste and I did not give it any sourness. I give it two sourness. Are you eat it? I give it 40. I give it 40. I give it a, a thousand out of 110. One light, a little light, a tiny. And it's really sour. Is that it? Yeah, that was it, guys. And there's only two things we like. Let me see the box. Sure. Let's Tell them a fun fact of news about New Zealand. Okay. A fun fact about New Zealand is high schools in New Zealand are entitled by law to one pound of uranium and one pound of thorium, but under the new under the Nuclear Test Ban Act, there is a fine of one million dollars for creating nuclear explosions. Okay, that's weird. Um, another fun fact is there is an official wizard of New Zealand. He was appointed by... He wears a pointy hat and robes. Cool. New Zealand's largest city, Auckland, is surrounded by about 50 volcanoes. Wow. Oh. That's crazy. Hey, Mom. Do 
Did what? you go buy volcanoes made of islands? Yeah. Another fun fact is Sir Edmund Hillary, the first man to climb Mount Everest, is from Auckland, New Zealand. And the last fun fact is New Zealand was once home to the moa, a flightless bird that could grow up to 12 feet tall. Wow. It's a beautiful country. Hey, Mom. We, every, and as we usually tell you is to go get yourself a snack crate and have some fun with snacks from around the world. I need a flop. Hashtag snack crate. Bye guys. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> they see you next time guys. Go check us out on Instagram, Lily and Bane's World. That's not nice. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Bye, guys. Bye.